the 14th of March 1992, the body of Michelle Brown was discovered in an old shed at the rear of Miles Gun Shop in Frankston North. Michelle's body was found in a state of severe decomposition and it was determined that she had been murdered by a person or persons unknown. Michelle was one of five children and lived with her mother, father and younger brother at the time of her death. She was a natural athlete and played for the under-17s Victoria State netball side until a knee injury stopped her from continuing. As a result of Michelle's injury, her lifestyle deteriorated and she began to associate with persons involved in criminal activity. Michelle was described as a loyal friend, so much so that it often led to people taking advantage of her goodwill. Homicide detectives are seeking your help in solving this murder. Michelle was last seen alive on the evening of Sunday the 1st of March 1992, which was her 25th birthday. At around 12pm that day, Michelle was picked up from her home in Baxter by a friend and driven to another friend's house in Frankston North, where she stayed until around 7pm. Michelle and a female friend then walked to the Food Plus store in Frankston Dandenong Road, which took them about five minutes. Michelle borrowed 30 cents from her friend and made a phone call to her brother asking for her mother to come and pick her up from Frankston Railway Station. Michelle's friend left her at the Food Plus door and was then given a lift home by friends passing by. Michelle was seen walking away from the Food Plus store between 7 and 7.15 p.m. It's not confirmed how she travelled to or even if she arrived at the railway station in Frankston, which is approximately 3.8 kilometres from the Food Plus store. A taxi driver saw a woman who he believed to be Michelle near the phone boxes at the Frankston railway station between 8 and 9 p.m. We are asking for anybody who saw a female fitting Michelle's description in or around the public telephone box at the Frankston railway station between 8 and 9 p.m. on Sunday the 1st of March 1992 to contact Crime Stoppers on 1800 333 000. A witness who resided near Plain Street in Frankston North reported hearing two separate screams at a time shortly after 9pm and we are asking for anyone who may have seen or heard anything suspicious or unusual in the vicinity around and including Plain Street Frankston North on the evening of Sunday the 1st of March 1992 to please contact Crime Stoppers. Michelle's mother arrived at the Frankston railway station shortly after 8pm to pick up Michelle but could not locate her daughter. It was unusual for Michelle not to be waiting when asked to be picked up and Michelle's mother drove around looking for a while before returning home. It wasn't uncommon for Michelle's parents not to see her for a few days at a time and as a result she wasn't reported missing by her mother until 12 days later on the 13th of March 1992. On the 14th of March 1992, a staff member who worked at Miles Gun Shop in Frankston North discovered Michelle's body in an old shed out the back. The shed was accessible from the railway line and surrounded by blackberry bushes. Homicide detectives would like to speak to anyone who may have seen anything at the rear of the gun shop in Frankston North or the vacant block of land at the rear of that location. Michelle was just 25 years old at the time of her murder and the horrific nature of her death is unimaginable. After 28 years, it could be your information that helps us solve the murder of Michelle Brown.